College Silver Stacker here. All right, guys. So a while back, um, I won a free piece of silver from a guy that was doing a giveaway. Great piece. It was a uh, silver buffalo. You may have seen it in my generic stack somewhere. Um, so I used that. In, if you had seen some of my hydroponic videos that I did on my other channel, um, I used it in a experiment where I put it in with some hydrogen peroxide and was using it in the garden to put some extra silver in the water. And with my other silver pieces that I used, it worked great. And when they contacted the hydrogen peroxide, you saw them tarnish. However, this piece did not, so I questioned it. Anyway, long story short, took it to the local. He said it was actually silver. It must have just had something on it. I said, well, I don't want it anymore, so give me a partial trade. And he did. So for a partial trade, I was able to pick this amazing 2016 two ounce high ultra high relief Kraken piece. You can see how thick that is. Absolutely fantastic looking piece. This is from the Elemental Mint. Remember this is two ounces. And it did come in the airtight from my local. I don't know how they, I believe they ship normally in flips. So part of the added value was the fact that this one was already in an airtight. So let's see if you can see this in the video. I'm going to try real hard to turn this slowly and you guys can see just how high that relief mark is. I mean, this is incredible. Um... You can really see it right here on the tentacle. Look at that. That is just fantastic. It is amazing depth. When you see this coin in person, it is just gorgeous. So with a coin like this, you're definitely going to be paying a premium. Um, I was fortunate that my local really wasn't asking much over spot for this. Um, Plus, I was able to give in a partial trade on something that I had won for free. So, I really got a fantastic deal on this. Um, these are, are what I would consider, you know, it's a generic. So, you have to be careful because the collector value can disappear overnight. So, if you're going to collect these and pay the premium for them, you have to want the artwork. Your, your stacking for investment sake goes out the window with this. And I want you guys to understand that. Um, I know some people have commented, you know, stay away from the artwork stuff. My thing is, is if you like it, stack it. Uh, you're still stacking silver at the end of the day. But remember, this is not melt value. I mean, it... Actually, I should say, no, it is melt value. Anything over melt value that you're paying for it is simply for the pure pleasure of owning it. And that's it. Um, there's a good chance you'll be able to get it back out when you flip it, but you never know. So remember when you're stacking stuff like this, plan on only getting whatever spot value is back out of it. So it's a fantastic piece. It looks uh, absolutely amazing with that ultra high relief. Um, and you want this to be in an airtight, so you're going to have to pay the extra money for the airtight. Um, just because it's such a beautiful piece and you'd hate to ruin that kind of artwork. It is three nines fine silver, and so this is just an absolutely gorgeous piece. I'm glad it came home, but only one is coming home. All right, so real quickly, now that this is in my collection, um, I've got some amazing news for you guys. Similar to this, and if you are familiar with the high-relief um, Cleopatra coin, the two-ounce Cleopatra, Providence Metals is coming out with a new coin series, the first of which is going to be a two-ounce ultra-high-relief Anubis coin. Now, it is not on the website yet. Um, I was able to get some inside information on it. I'm hoping to have one as soon as they're released, just to show you guys. Again, just like this, it's artwork. It's a generic the only reason to pay that kind of premium is if you get a gift card or something crazy and you understand that the spot value is what it is. Um, and that's, that's all you may get out of it. Hopefully you can flip it for more, but otherwise it's just a cool piece to have in the collection. So anyway, check out that and 
I hope to see you guys in future videos. Please like and subscribe. Tell me what you guys like and what you don't like, and we'll see what we can do in the future. All right, thank you guys.